In this video, I'm going to be um, working on an individual integral. We're going to be taking a look at the integral of cotangent squared 3x dx. Now, before we start, <clears throat> I'm going to uh, draw your attention to this Pythagorean identity. This is a Pythagorean identity that you should have memorized. 1 plus cotangent squared x equals cosecant squared x. Okay, this identity also would follow suit if I would change those x's like say to 3x, 3x, which I have 3x here. All right, then we can take this quantity and we can solve for cotangent squared of 3x by subtracting one from both sides and then we have an equivalent identity. <clears throat> so what we're going to do here before we start this integration is we're going to do this substitution. Okay, so I'm going to be uh, switching this to the integral of cosecant squared of 3x minus 1 <clears throat> dx. Okay, now from here it's going to be a straight u substitution because I do have a nice little 3x sitting there as an inside function. So I'm going to let my u be 3x. I'm going to take the derivative of both sides, so du, it will be equal to 3 dx, and then I can divide both sides by 3, so du over 3 is equal to dx. Okay, now after I do that, then I can come up and I can substitute in. <clears throat> so I'll have the integral. I'll have cosecant squared. The 3x can be replaced with a u, and then I'll have the minus 1. Um, and then replacing dx with what that equals, a du over 3. <clears throat> then that's going to allow me to pull out a 1 -third. So when I pull out that one third, I'll have a one third <clears throat> times the integral of cosecant squared u minus one, and then du. From here, I'm going to separate this into two individual integrals. So I'll have one third times the integral of cosecant squared u du minus the integral of one du. All right, now this one you should have memorized. The integral of cosecant squared u is a negative cotangent u, so hopefully that is memorized at this point. So I can have the one-third out in front. <clears throat> Integrating that, I get the negative cotangent u there. Integrating a 1 with a du is just going to give me a u, so I'll have a minus u. And then going ahead and putting that plus c on. Distributing the one third, I'm going to then have a, with that negative out in front, a negative one third cotangent u negative, so minus one third u plus c, and then replacing my u with what it is, uh, is a 3x, I'll then have a negative one third cotangent of 3x minus one-third times a 3x, and then plus c. Now, going one step farther there, one-third times three is going to cross out, so then I can just have a plain x there. So let's go ahead and write that simplified answer there. Negative one-third cotangent of 3x minus x plus c as a final answer there. Okay, so pretty much after that initial um, substitution of that Pythagorean identity, it then became a straight u sub integral. And then be sure to separate that into two separate integrals and integrate them individually and straightforward problem. Definitely, thanks for watching. Don't forget to share with your friends and please subscribe to the channel. Thanks.